I showed the kids the trailer of King Kong because that's the only thing I could possibly let them watch. Or within 20 seconds of, of watching it, my little one started crying and I went, oh no, this is the worst bit of parenting I could have yeah. possibly done. You know, I'm getting sacrificed yeah. to a, yeah. a gorilla. Like, this is not good yeah. images to put in your kid's yeah. head. And I am reunited with Naomi Watts and we are going to be talking about her film here about Ray. Uh, which is very on topic, certainly with Vanity Fair and our Caitlyn Jenner story. Shot, yeah, yeah. With that shot heard around the world. In this movie, you play the mother to Elle Fanning, who is uh, Raymond, yeah, Ramona to yeah, Raymond, yeah. and you're kind of like struggling with that as any mom Parent, would. Yeah. yeah, it just really moved me. The script was, um, you know, this great fi family dynamic, and at the center of it, something important and mm -hmm. and sensitive, but. Um, and the kid transitioning, but also all of us handling it and dealing with it in our own unique ways. It can be funny and painful, yeah. but no matter what, we got to connect on this somehow together. And it just felt like a true journey of, of um, transition for yeah. everyone. And he's been presenting and identifying as a boy since an early age. But now we're getting to the next step, which is the, the medication. And that's basically, um, her decision because she's got to sign mm -hmm. this form and, um, and I, that's just a whole new thing that brings up more conflict and you know the burden of, of making that decision by herself because the father's not present. Mm -hmm. it, it's a tough position so she's sort of messy and acting out but mm -hmm. trying to get it done at the same time. You yeah, know I love the humor in it and then the, it, 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 it's a nice balance and I actually like that I could it felt very real to me. Uh, Mulholland Drive I think about that film. What are some takeaways from that? Because that really was at, I remember seeing that movie at a festival, I think it was at Sundance or something, when that. Um, no, can. Can, it, right. It, it, yeah. Um, but yeah, I, that was an incredible experience. David Lynch, just one of the all time great filmmakers. And, um, and I think that sort of shaped me as a, as a actor because after that I just wanted to have more experiences of working with great directors and I do believe mm -hmm. film is a director's medium and um, and even if the role is is not as substantial it's worth being on the set and in the presence of someone with mm -hmm. a terrific mind like that and just learn from mm -hmm. them and help them create their vision. Do you see him ever around? I do, yeah. I do, we kept in touch and especially now I'm spending more time in LA um, and um, but you always go to Davy, David's compound and sit there and drink large cups of coffee and watch him smoke cigarettes yeah. <laughs> um, and tell stories. He's just, he's a really terrific man who's um, just good company.